All right, guys, this is my first ever real life video. As you know, I'm a gamer. And Lissy dragged me out here to uh, the Minnesota's most haunted tower. We're in Duluth currently. It, it, there's the tower. It's called Edgar's Tower, no, right? Edgar, Edgar. I'm really bad at this. Apparently, some ghost is on the fifth floor, and we're gonna try communicating or getting evidence of it tonight. Um, we're coming back when it's dark. It's currently light. The rumor is that there's a man on the fifth floor, right, Lissy? Yes that there's a man that people have seen on the fifth floor. You can see him in the window up there walking around and people can hear him talk and hear footprints. Yeah, so we're gonna see if that's really true. So uh, let's cut back to that. Are you excited? I'm excited. Yeah. I'm really excited to see if this place is truly haunted or if it's just myths or legends, but it turns I, I think we'll it's stay, actually right? haunted. Guys, if we can get 500 likes on this video, we will come back to Duluth and we will tour one of the most haunted boats in the Great Lakes, right? Yes. So the fifth floor is actually right up there, right before the top of this tower. That's gonna be our primary focus. As you can see, we are literally like hundreds of feet above Minnesota as it is. That's Lake Superior right there. And then that river, well, I, I actually don't know what that river's called. So me and Lissy are actually about to go into it, right Lissy? Yes, we're about to go in we're right now. We're going in, we're going in right now. And um, it's, it, it, it's gonna be something. We're gonna see if we can get something in daylight. Let's go try to talk to Edgar Allan Poe. <laughs> There's literally so many stairs. Oh my God, I look old. Look at my hairline. What the heck? I got the hairline of an old man. Oh my God. I'm balding. I'm gonna die at age 40 from hair loss. What? Ghosts aren't real. They are real. No. They are. No, they're not. I'm gonna make you think differently tonight. What does that mean? Okay, so we've officially made it to the fifth floor during day. Oh my God, my hair, I need to go bald. Dark corners, come help me out, bro. What? I'm going bald, Lissy. I like your hair. No, so yeah, there's nothing going on up here. Still nothing. I don't know what Lissy's talking about. I don't think this is actually well, haunted. Most of the spiritual activity, I hate to be very particular with you, that happens from the time about 12 at night till three in the morning is when things are most active. I don't think that's right. I don't think that's right at all. All right, guys, we're here at night now. Um, we're gonna go investigate the tower. You ready? You ready? I'm ready. I'm a little nervous. Yeah, but I am I'm too. There's other people here as well. They're they're walking around, so this might be a little bit random. So we'll see. We are going up the staircase currently to the fifth floor where something terrible happened. Something horrifying. Yeah, yeah, something actually horrifying. Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna find anything tonight. So we've made it to the fifth floor. This is the floor where something terrible happened. How many years ago, 1940 something? I don't know to be exact, but. The story is somebody jumped off yeah. from this floor and unfortunately unalived themselves. So we're gonna be trying to use different tools here in a little bit to see if we can get any evidence of paranormal. Yeah. <laughs> Can't use anything wind sensitive tonight, unfortunately. All right, guys, so we have here a REM pod, which if you touch it or anything gets around it, it will actually go off. See how it goes off like that? So it light up green if there's any energy that touches it. Anywhere near it. That's well, a temperature change. Whoa. So we're already seeing stuff here, guys, because it's this cold. is really active and it's cold. So then we also have this EMF tool here. What do you think about this EMF tool? One second. Oh, Sorry. that thing is freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> so this EMF takes a lot of energy. It will light up to red or orange if anything puts enough force into this. Yeah. With a magnetic field, I guess ghosts can communicate by messing with technology. And this one right here is our spirit box. Oh God, so this phasmophobia. One connects to radios and it scans through and we can pick up words, sentences even sometimes, and names with this. Oh geez, okay. All right guys, so I'm actually gonna be looking around with the EMF tool first. I'm gonna be sensing around and seeing if anything wants to communicate through. EMF, oh God, it's windy up here. We're about, uh, I wanna say 200 feet above the ground currently. And yeah, unfortunately the story is true from earlier. Uh, is that right, Lissy? Yes. Is something beeping off over there No, already? I'm trying to put the teddy bear up. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so we're gonna see, we're gonna test around with this for a little bit and we're gonna see if we can get something to set it off. God, that is terrifying. Anything wanna talk to me? I'm lonely and I'm with Lissy. I'm going to see if we can get anything on the spirit box because I would use the rods, Ooh. but it's almost too windy. Isn't it the windiest day ever? Yeah, I don't know why it's so windy, but it is also changing seasons. Yeah. So unfortunate, yeah. 
Are you going to ask it a question? Yeah, we're going to ask it questions. We're going to take turns. Okay. Hello, spirits. We are here. And if you guys would like... Whoa, Ooh, that was a lot of wind at once. Maybe a that's a sign. If you guys would like to make yourselves known, this is uh, Lissy and this is... Uh, Trent. And we would love to hear you guys come through to say hello. Can hey. we... Can we um, get an answer if you guys are here? Can you say hello to us? I haven't heard anything yet. If there is a spirit here, can you say how many of how many spirits are present by giving us a number? I thought I heard four. Four? I heard that, twice. That's not right. That's not right though because only. There could be different spirits attached to a land here. You do know that, right? What? If there's four spirits here, can we hear a yes or a no? What's this that? is. I heard them say this is. Okay. Are you guys men or women or both? They said both. I heard both. You heard both? Yeah. Can you guys say one of your names? Can you say your name? James. I, I heard James. James. You heard yeah. that? I heard, yeah, James I heard James Roland or something. That's weird. Paul. I heard Paul too. Can you say one of our names to show that you're here with us? I heard Alyssa. My real name? Yeah. That's scary. Do you like us being here with you? The EMF just went off a little bit on its own. That's weird. That's weird. I, I swear I heard it say no and then like the F word. I swear. Wait, really? Are you guys angry at us for being here? Are you angry at us? Be responsible. Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard that. That was a little weird. All right, so Lissy just set up the REM pod and it was... Oh. It's going off by itself currently. And so, it was going off on its own for just a second, but it stopped. Did you see that? Yeah, yeah, I caught it actually on You film. caught it on, yeah. I literally started I, my I camera just, just a second too late, guys. As it was happening. I want to put a flash or like a light this way. So, oh, 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 oh my gosh. This what just got knocked that? over right as I, oh, is it still going off? That was so weird, but. Why is it going off like that? It was this? going off on its own and something knocked it over. That was creepy. Why do I keep missing the important footage? Well, I think that's wind pushing it now. Well, that's wind. Yeah. But it got pushed over so quickly. And like I was saying earlier, Lissy was literally playing with these sticks. And there's wind here. And it was going away. It keeps falling onto me, though. That's weird. That okay. is really weird. There's not a lot of wind right there's now, There's not either. that much wind against the wall. So that's kind of suspicious. It's by the teddy, and that's not been going hey, on. You might want to get that teddy out of that crack. It could fall out. Oh, that's an open hole. Yeah. Ah! What? Wait, why did that one go off? I don't know. Hold on, I have an idea. I'm going to move this bear over okay. here. All right. He's moving the bear over there. So I'm going to make sure he's going to be pushed up against this wall. Yeah, so that's how he goes off when censored. So he won't get blown. And then can you move this one too? Yeah, I'll move this one as well. We're going to move this one against the wall. We're going to move this one against... Uh, let's move it against this wall yeah. right here. This is the hardest investigation I've ever done. Yeah, this is really interesting. So though. much weather. If this goes off and if the teddy bear goes off, yeah. it's 100% on its own because they're yeah. pushed up against the they're wall against the now. the wall and there's no wind hitting them. So they're yeah. just sitting there. And then we can turn this one on too. I haven't turned this one let's on. Let's try to set the, the EMFs change. off. Yeah, we'll wait for this big one, but we're going to see if these EMFs go. What the? It's when you push them. Okay, yeah. So we're going to see if those go off on their own as well. Yeah. Nothing yet. Let's see. Okay, so right now, this one is actually going off. That's going off. This one's going off oh on my its gosh. own. That's completely. the first thing of the night. We just got that REM pod on tape. I missed the teddy this bear. This one's still going it's off. It's still going off, yeah. I missed the teddy bear lighting up on its own all the way over there. I wish I could get that on camera again for you guys. Yeah, the teddy bear literally went off on its own. I know. I can't believe we missed that. Oh, oh, oh it, that It's ticking this off. one. It's ticking this one. That one's going off. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Multiple touches. Hold up. And that one's He's, against the wall. Yeah, no, that one's completely That's out of the wind. That's crazy, guys. I'm sitting down. Oh, it went again. Oh, it's going again. Hold on. I really want that bear to go off again because that's insane to catch on camera. That oh. one is still that going off That one's active. Over there. Yeah, he must be over here. Thank you for giving us a sign. Can you please touch the EMFs? 
or light the EMFs to red. It just keeps touching that it one. It just keeps liking that one over there. Jeez. We actually have uh, communication with this ghost now. God, I am so pale. Maybe I'm the ghost here, Lissy. If you are here, can you give us a sign by crossing the rods? Thank you. Oh, he is crossing them. Okay. If, if you would like to talk to us further, can you please open the rods against the wind to show that you are happy that we're here? Thank you so much. That's so weird, because the wind, look at her hair right now. It's blowing that way, and this one just turned all the way it's still, towards. It's still going. It's blinking that right now. Oh my gosh. If you are the man or the spirit of the man who lurks on the fifth floor, can you please open the rods as fast as you can for me to say hello? Wow, thank you so much. I'm glad to be communicating with you. Do you like this tower? Is this tower special to you? If so, can you cross the rods if you like it? If you don't like it, can you open the rods? This one's conflicted. Yeah. They're opening. He must oh, not. He doesn't like it. He doesn't. I'm so sorry. If this tower reminds you of a hard time in your life, can you please cross the rods? Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. So I think what he's trying to say to us right now is that he, well, unfortunately, from the story or er, story earlier, you know what happened, and I don't. I think he, maybe he regrets it. I think he could regret it since he's trying to convey that like he's here, but he might regret what he did here. Yeah. I'm gonna ask another question. Okay. Spirit um, of the tower, do you have a regret from your life that you wish you can go back and relive? Cross the rods if yes. That was a fast cross. That was really fast. I'm so sorry. And it's not like the wind's doing anything because it's been no. gusting like this the whole time. If you would like to communicate further with us, can you open the rods to show that you're happy for us to be here? Can you cross the rods if you don't like us? Ooh. Oh, God. If you would like to cause harm to one of us, can you open the rods as fast as you can? Ooh. Um, if you are a friendly spirit, can you cross the rods? If you are an evil, demonic spirit, can you open the rods? Lissy, why are you taking me here on our first try? If you are being a prankster, can you cross the rods? If not, can you open the rods? Please tell me he's pranking us. He's opening the rods. He's not lying. I'm scared. Oh my god. Okay, Lizzie. um, I didn't expect that. Hey, all I gotta say is if I don't make it back from this video, hit that like button <laughs> and subscribe. Oh my god, my hairline is a felony. Damn. You should have got a matching hat with me. Okay, guys, so we're going to be using uh, this app here, and it's a ghost spirit box app. And this app here has actually given me the most clear words even more clear than my spirit box I brought here. So we're gonna see if we can get any clear answers from the spirit who is not happy to have us here in the fifth floor of the tower. You, get, you ready? No. Okay, we're both gonna answer, <laughs> ask questions, okay? All right, you. Hello, spirits. Um, I am Lissy. I'm Birdie. And we would love to know if you would like to communicate with us tonight. Lissy! It just said Lissy! Did you hear that? That was weird. Hold on. I can't make that up. It said Lissy. I'm putting my camera down. I think down. it said Lissy. Hi. Hello. I would love to know if you guys are friendly spirits. Did it just tell you to shut up? Did you say to shut up? Oh, <gasps> you shut up. No. Are you an angry spirit? I'm angry! It whispered, I'm angry in a mean voice. Did you hear that? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. It's a demon! It's a demon? Are you a demon? I think it said I am. Can you please say your name for us? Leroy. I, I, I think it's not telling us, honestly. I thought I heard Leroy. Is Leroy your name? Yeah. That's a pretty cool name. 
He said, yeah. Yeah. He agrees. Do you want to ask some questions? Sure. Go ahead. Hold it and ask some questions. How old are you? Five? Five, eight? Five. Maybe are you a child? What? I said I am in a kid's voice. I didn't hear that. Is there a ghost of a child here as well with us present? Do you want us to be here? I think he said I hope. Maybe. Go away! It said go away in the clearest voice. Did you hear that? No, I didn't it hear said it. go away. I'm gonna replay that in the video and you're gonna get the chills. It's a go away. Would you like us to leave? It said yes. That was so clear. Are you sure you'd like us to leave? No? Never come back? I didn't hear that. Should we come back? He said go away again. Calm down. Can you light up the EMF to show you're here? <gasps> I didn't see it. It's lighting up right now! It is? Yeah, look! What the frick is going on? Is this you lighting up the EMF? That's me. It said hi. Hi. It did a big hi. There. If you're a nice spirit, can you light up the EMF to red? <gasps> it went to orange. Hey, no. Maybe it's be, maybe it's being nice. To, maybe it's a shy ghost. Are you shy? Shy. It said. Yeah. Did you hear that? Yeah. Bird. Birdie. It said bird. It said bird. Uh, you know what? I, I'm nice. Uh, nice to meet you. Can you say the name of the place that we are at right now for us? It said Edgar. Did, Did you? it? Yeah. Did it actually? Yeah, yeah. It said. Replay that. Replay that, editor. I, it should have picked that up. It literally said Edgar. Can you say that again one more time, please? Where are we located? Oh, ah! You see? Ah! Ed. It it's said Ed. 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 It I can't even make that up. Oh, this one's actually cool. Can you say the city that we are in? Duluth. It said Duluth. I have chills down my too. whole body. Oh, well, yeah, it's cold here. No, but like actual from this. Oh. Does this tower make you guys happy? Oh, oh, the, the bear, bear just went off. off. The oh bear went gosh. off. The bear just went off. Oh my gosh. Oh man. Did you guys set the bear off? Did you set the bear off? I did. It said, it said I did. It, said, it told me to shut up. It just whispered, shut up. I'm turning it off. Oh my gosh. That was a crazy investigation, guys. I'm starting to feel a little uncomfortable. I'm not. Let's go for five more minutes. Okay. Five more minutes. I want, I want to see the bear. I'm going to go over by the bear, and we're going to actually see. Wait, where's my light? So now I'm hanging out right by the bear. I'm actually going to put the camera right here, and I'm going to try talking to the spirit and seeing if it's going to touch the bear for me. And just for example, this is how hard you have to touch it. For Like, I literally have to physically touch it in order for it to get set off. Like, I, I look, my hand has to be on it. Spirit, if you're here and you want us to leave, can you please touch the bear? If you're here and want us to stay, can you please touch the bear? Touch the other rim pod. Yeah, I heard that. So my boyfriend is seeing if the bear will go off for him if he sits over by it and asks them politely to touch it. I have set off this one. <gasps> oh my what gosh! Is, why is the rim right pod going off? As I, right as I turned this one to say I, had, I have set it down, it just went off. I got that on camera. Was that, what does that mean? That one means something touched it. Something touched it? Thank you for showing you're here. That one's going crazy over yeah, there. Yeah, I hear one going crazy over there. Can you touch the REM pod again to show that you're excited that we're here today? Can you touch the REM pod again to show that you're the man, the spirit of the man who sits on the fifth floor? <gasps> oh my gosh! It's still lighting it's, it up. That it's, is the answer. That is the spirit of the man here. on the fifth floor. Are you happy to have us here? 
Light it green if you like us. Light it to green or another color to show that you're happy that we're here to communicate with you today, to hear your story. Can you show us another sign that you're here with us? By touching the bear, yeah, setting off my REM pod, please? Anything. Well, thank you for the sign that you show. Oh, oh my gosh, he said it. He said there it's green. Is. Yeah, that means that he wants us here. He does want us here. This is the most this evidence so, I've gotten in a long time. This is just so contradicting. This it's still insane. going off. He's that so excited. That takes a lot of force. Yeah, the green thank is so like much. really. <gasps> it's again. It's, it's still, he went again. Oh my gosh. He's setting off two colors now. Oh my gosh, I've never seen my REM pod do this before, Whoa. guys. Whoa, it's orange now. Oh my gosh, okay. Thank you for showing us a sign. Yeah, thank you for showing us this that. This is crazy. Oh my gosh. Um, if you would like to um, have us ask you about your life story and understand the connection to the tower, can you please push, set off the REM pod? <gasps> Instantly. Okay, And you're not you. even near it. Oh my gosh, the Wait, other one's going up. the bear's up. going The bear, up. oh my gosh. Jeez, okay, this is crazy. He's, he didn't even He's push active. it down. He's active. Yeah, no, I literally was like over here. like You didn't touch it No, at I all. didn't. I, I sat it back up at the end, but that it was still going off. Again? Oh my gosh, he has that on camera too. That's crazy. Spirit of the fifth floor. Can you set off the, the REM pod if you had a happy life? Thank you. Oh, hey. Thank you for giving us a sign. Yeah. So he had a happy life. That's good. That's good. I'm glad to hear that. Can you set off the REM pod if you were lonely in your life? Or you wanted more friends? Oh my gosh. That's so sad. This is sad. Okay. Well, we're happy to talk to you. Whew. Can you set off the REM pod again to green? If you haven't... I don't even know what I was going to say. <laughs> it still set it, it off. Still set he's, it off. He's hype. I was going to try to say if you haven't crossed over. I'm so sorry to hear that. Wait, why is it doing double? That means it's being really active. I've never seen my Wait, red pod go off it's like It's this. doing the ultra one. Oh my gosh. This is crazy to me, guys. I've never seen this I've, much activity. I think we should... What are, you, what are you thinking? Would you like us... Oh my gosh. I was going to say, would you like us to go? But it's still going off. If you would like us to go, can you touch all the colors at once, please? Thank you. Can you set off all the colors at once if you'd like us to leave? If you'd like us to stay, can you set off all the colors at once? Well, it's setting off the REM pod over there. Yeah. Maybe he only has so much energy. Well, thank you for communicating yeah. tonight. Yeah, it was great to talk to you. Um, what, would you what do you have to say? I think that he had a story of something in his life. Maybe he had a happy life at one point, but things went wrong and he regrets his decision. Yeah. That's kind of what I'm getting out of this. Yeah. Yep. I don't so, think he's evil. I think he's maybe a prankster. Yeah, I think he's a little bit of a goofy goober. Anyway, guys, I think that's going to conclude our little investigation of the fifth floor. He doesn't want us to go, apparently. What the f Oh, now you're touching it, but that's terrifying. That is.